Woods. We are here at Buffalo Park for the annual Star Party. Now this year they are adding a new addition, which is the field day, including telescopes that can look at the sun as well as crafts and activities that you can do. Now follow us along tonight as we explore the universe. Flagstaff is known for the dark skies and phenomenal stargazing and went down in history in 2001 as the first ever international dark sky city. Dark Sky Coalition member William Seven says there is a reason this coalition started. Yeah, but in 1999, a group of people here decided they wanted to help the observatories deal with the encroaching light pollution from car dealerships and billboards and everything else. And you see no billboards along Route 66 anymore. That was part of that group of people um, that worked with the Dark Skies Coalition. The goal of the Star Party is to educate the Flagstaff community about the universe and why our dark sky city is so important. Tours around the United States Geological Survey Building are taking place as well, showing the moon rover that astronauts used to practice with here in Flagstaff and also features high-definition pictures of our solar system. 1869 was the year John Wesley Powell explored the Grand Canyon. He, he went down the Grand Canyon on the raft. A hundred years later, we're landing on the moon. Wow. So where are we going to be in 2069? Where are you going to be? Travelers are coming in from all over the world, from an Egyptologist speaker flying in from Egypt to visitors from Connecticut. Ann and Carl are on a cross-country trip and made the Flagstaff Star Party a priority. Driving around at night, it's definitely darker and the lights are pointing down and of course the yellow lights rather than. So we have so much light pollution in Connecticut. But it's nothing like nothing here like and the dark skies. So you can definitely tell that Flagstaff has made it their priority to keep it a dark sky. Definitely. The Star Party will continue through Saturday night and is free for everyone. For more information on the Flagstaff Festival of Science, visit sciencefest.org. Tori Smith, NAZ Today.